after watching this video uh, you will able to create a create your own browser like this here you can search anything I will just write down here open AI and it will open and then you can come back okay you can just come back and you can go uh, forward and you can reload the page and you can type by URL okay if I write down here https colon youtube.com then see it will open the YouTube so you can do all of the basic functionality on here so this is uh, pretty simple and we will uh, build this we will build this web browser using ChatGPT, and we don't need to write a single line of code all of the code will write the ChatGPT for us so first of all I will close it so I will just uh, use uh, VS code and in your case you can use anything so first of all uh, you need to install a library called QTPY okay so for installing the library just uh, uh, follow this command okay just uh, write down here pip install QTPY and then uh, it will install the QTPY library uh, however you just create this uh, create this py file open that directory on your terminal okay so this is the uh, basic first thing so now just open your chat gpt so i will just write down here create a web browser using python and qtpy and then i'll press enter and uh, uh, first of all it will explain the thing and then it will write the code for us see it's explaining how he how he will do all of the things and it's writing the code okay so see uh, it's done uh, uh, just to copy the code and uh, just copy the code from here okay just uh, uh, copy the code and open your uh, VS Studio code or uh, whatever browser, uh, whatever ID you are using. Just open your ID and then uh, paste the code and then press Ctrl S for saving the uh, saving the file. So now open your terminal uh, and run the command. Okay, run the command. If I press enter, then see this time uh, it shows us examples domain. Uh, this is a error, uh, not error. Okay so uh, for solving that just open uh, open your uh, id and here you can see view.load uh, qurl here it is set by uh, example.com so here you need to set your uh, search engine so in my case i will just write down here google.com but if you want to if you want to use another search engine like yahoo.com or duckduckgo.com then uh, set the url on here and then press ctrl s for save the file and then open your terminal and just uh, press the chrome at python browser.py and see this time our browser is done if i write down here anything and see this is working properly but now we are not able to see here uh, backward forward and refresh page okay and also we cannot search by link by url okay so for doing that just uh, close uh, close close your browser and open your chat gpt and then i will just write down here uh, great now can you please add some basic functionality like backward forward refresh and link search and then press enter and this time it will add some functionality on our code and our code is done now just copy the code and uh, press ctrl a and delete it and press ctrl v for paste uh, paste it uh, paste the code okay and then uh, press ctrl s for save the uh, save the file and then open your terminal and then write python browser.py and then press enter and see this time uh, it shows example.domain okay so for solve that just uh, close it and then i will just uh, close it from here and then i will just open my vs code and here uh, we need to set we need to set here uh, google.com and press ctrl s for save this and open your terminal and write the command again python browser.py and see this time our browser is done if i search here anything open ai or whatever you can search and our browser is done and here now we can reload the page and we can uh, back uh, we can go forward we can go backward and uh, we can search by link okay if i write down here youtube.com and see this time it will open the youtube so this is done so this way you can build your own you can build your own web browser using python and using qtpy okay so this is pretty simple so that's it for this particular tutorial i think you guys learned something new from this video and i will meet you in the next one